this video, you will see the termination process for the FIS Cheetah Connector on 900 micron fiber. Here are the items necessary for installation. Fusion splicing machine. High precision cleaver. Optional heat shrink oven. Fiber stripper and scissors. Cleaning solution. And the FIS Cheetah Connector. Begin by sliding the 900 micron boot and splice protection sleeve onto the field fiber. Next, strip an inch to an inch and a half of the 900 micron jacket from the end of the field fiber. Be sure to remove all of the acrylate coating from the fiber. Wipe the fiber clean with cleaning solution before cleaving. Place the field fiber in the splicer's removable 900 micron holder. Be sure to place the buffer to the end of the holder to ensure the proper cleave length of 10 millimeter. Cleave the fiber. And place on the left side of the machine. Take the FIS Cheetah SOC, remove the cleave protector and ferrule cap. Place the connector into the FIS Cheetah SOC holder. Place the connector holder on the right side of the splicing machine. The setup should look as shown before performing the splice. Close splicer lid and splice fibers together. Remove clamp on fiber holder and bring splice sleeve up. Lift the field fiber and allow the splice sleeve to slide to the connector, pushing the sleeve to position as needed. Before shrinking, the sleeve should sit as shown. Set the connector holder onto the heat shrink oven and set connector and splice sleeve as shown. Start the heat cycle on the oven and the start button will begin to blink. When the light begins to blink faster, the cooling cycle has started. If additional heating time is needed, you can press the start button again to initiate a reheat cycle of 15 seconds. Once the sleeve is shrunk, remove the connector and allow the splice to cool. Slide the 900 micron boot flush up to the back of the connector. For SC style connectors, Snap on the outer housing, making sure the keyway is on top when installing. You have now completed the FIS Cheetah Splice-On Connector.